Another interesting generator is metaball. The metaball change your uh, object to the molecule shapes, for example. For example, I insert two sphere and make a copy of them and <clears throat> insert a metal ball and select them and click the drag and make a child of the metal ball. As you can see, this happened. If you click and change the position of the sphere, this effect like a molecular movement and attachment is will happen here. Okay, for more accurate and uh, better quality, you have to change the editor or render a subdivision. There, <clears throat> you can change uh, the number of here means the distance between the <clears throat> subdivision here. You can reduce the number to better subdivision this is the for example can make the five for example if you reduce this uh, increase this number and it's a very ugly bad in a viewer but it's a nice in a render it's a five centimeter you have to go into the render to the viewport uh, <clears throat> uh, render viewer and you can see this is in a subdivision in the viewport and this is a subdivision in render so if your uh, viewport is very heavy and you can move them, you can reduce the number here. So, in that we have another problem, and display graph changing, and you can see, you can assign any of other object here. It's not important how many. You can see, you can use this effect like this. Okay, it's very interesting. The hierarchy is not important here. Okay. This effect is metaball. And another setting of that is whole value. The whole value control the amount of the metal effect. Higher number, less metaball effect, and the smaller number, more metaball effect will be happen. <clears throat> Going to the metaball and exponential fall off. What is this? The exponential falloff is a mathematical uh, curve that occurs here. For example, it travel nothing here and accidentally and suddenly uh, do something for you. It's an exponential with a very big slope. And as this here, if this is turned off <clears throat> when you uh, return, when you close the metal ball to each other this suddenly uh, from the far distance they reach each other but if you activate exponential fall off if they are close to each other does not reach does not reach and when they close each other suddenly uh, metal ball effect will appear okay this is exponential fall off if you want to two objects that are close enough to each other, then metal ball effect happen. You can turn it on. An accurate normal, it's accurate. For example, this normal. If you click that, as you can see, these are uh, <clears throat> normal issues. You can click uh, uh, make a better result here. I explained what is the normal in previous lessons. Please refer to them. You can also assign a metal ball to any other uh, tools in a Cinema 4D. For example, I have a plane here that make it array. Uh, sorry, make it array. Oh, make it array and in its settings and object <clears throat> turn red reduce down and make an amplitude and the frequency and we can a movement here like this make more frequency here and you can assign the metal ball to this array <laughs> you can simply uh, insert the metal ball and click and drag the array under the metal ball 
And here we can increase, uh, reduce the hole, reduce the metal ball effect to see the objects, and better quality with subdivision distance, reduce it. And when you play, you can this effect here. You can assign metal ball to any object. And also you can assign metal ball to splines. It's very interesting too. Metal ball. Click and drag here. You can insert. You can copy your circle and assign it to the any uh, rectangle, any spline that you want. It's simple and easy. For example, insert a cock wheel here, going in a child of the meta ball, and here our meta ball here. Okay, that's meta ball. Hello, my friends. To continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.